beautiful rise and beautiful rise. So I think the first time that I was trying to do this, it wasn't working. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Shout out to TikTok Shop for the cheap mics. See how it sounds. Um, trying to isolate my sound from my son talking. I think I was speaking on Parenthood. It turned out to be like a six minute long video, and I was I was going in, so I'm gonna have to redo it. But the beautiful thing is, my mind is pretty clear, so I can I can still get it off. Parenthood. Dealing with children, under the understanding that that your babies will eventually go out into the world and do whatever it is that they want to do, whether you feel like you taught them right or not, whether you feel like you taught them enough or not. Some of these children, they are there, and all these children, <laughs> they're their own being. And the craziest thing is the fact that we have to respect the fact that we lived our life, we're in our body. Depending on if you learned your lesson or not, that's on you. But your children have their own lessons to learn, and that's what I'm saying. They, they, and sadly enough, they may be they may be stemmed from you, but your children they they have their own lessons to learn. They have their own path to go down. It's vital for us to give them the the information and the knowledge so they can turn it into wisdom and actually go out in this world and accomplish something, be something. But you you realize the amount of parents that are 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 uh, uh, human beings that. Are deciding not to have kids because of where the world is where it's going things like that um safety understood lack of lack of uh, a a solid man that actually take care of him understood understood what i really had to realize is like i i put a lot of the blame on a lot of stuff i would say i put that blame on myself so I, that's what i talked to my child about but i for the sake of the video i do realize how different of a person i am when I'm associating with, uh, with their mother, right? And no bashing, it's just, I see the differences. Not saying that they're good or bad, I just see them. I can't be more honest about it, but I won't. <laughs> but I have to realize I, I take a lot of that blame. Let me make sure I bust my butt to, 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 to put you in a better situation. But then I have to tell my daughter, do you realize like I can be rich? It doesn't really matter. I could be well off. I could be stable. It doesn't really matter. If you don't want to be a good person, you're not going to be a good person like that. That I'm pretty sure it flew over her head because it's just like, baby, it starts now. It's showing me that you don't want to be a good person. And I was say, or or and I even said this, I was say you we have to protect our families. I'm you know, I'm going to say it a thousand times. We got to protect our families because I I can tell when there's like some kind of energy that's interrupting the flow of the family. And. It takes it takes a lot of understanding and 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 I've been through this before to even see it and realize it to try to fix it. I understand, but it's like press your button, get your children in a better environment. If you got to pull your kids out of that environment, pull your kids out of that environment because I, I'm telling you, it's gonna destroy them and it's gonna destroy you watching them destroy themselves because of the situations that you didn't want to take them out of. Listen to what I just said. It's gonna destroy you. To watch them destroy themselves because of the hard work that you decided not to do to get them into a better situation. You was too busy worrying about a man. You was too busy worrying about a woman. You was too busy worrying about this. You was too busy worrying about that. I get it. Money is important. That was saying, but God ain't God ain't never had me lacking. That was I might I might I might be a bad listener from time to time, but God ain't never had me lacking when I followed His word. Never. His 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 understanding. And that's what I'm saying. Like I don't. I don't, I don't care to mingle. That's, it's not about that. You know what I'm I know a good, a good tribe is is necessary, but 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 figure yourself out first. Like stop, stop crying and being up. We can do better, right? To wrap this up, I'll I'll repeat the story that I had said earlier. So hopefully, I can say it a little bit faster. Uh, I was watching SVU situation it was this girl uh she wasn't white but she was she was not from here from one of the iceland areas right mom comes out here try to give her a good life she's going to school she in chicago this is an episode where they're talking about drill rap right so when we in the shy they talking about drill the girl's a little video vixen I, I i completely forgot that in the first video that i made she's a video vixen but she's in school so uh it sounds like she might be close to college, maybe, maybe, maybe not. Hanging out with the black, with the rappers, drug dealers. So that's what I'm saying. So apparently, one of the dudes in this other man's crew 
has a crush on her. She like, oh, I can get that set up. They set the whole thing up. Dude, they run in the dude spot, shoot him, shoot the shoot the little boy that got the crush on the girl. He got he's in a wheelchair. Shot the security guard. He bleeding out. His gun starts. All right, so the white girl, the white girl ends up getting shot, and that I'm saying she ends up getting left. Like she's like, no, don't leave me. And I'm just like, bruh, in the hospital, they like, you know, it was a crime. Whoop whoop. She's not. They don't even know she a part of it. They pick up dude, and dude was like, Psh. like I don't care if I'm going down, but she going down with me. And that's what I'm saying. So now they trying to, they trying to get him through her, not realizing. She was essayed, abused, all this other stuff. But listen to what I'm saying. She was in the environment so long, she started to like it. She started to like the chaos. The peace was not fun for her. Now, what I realized, what I realized from a long time ago, probably until now, is that being bored is like, it's a good thing. I know people don't use the term blessing anymore, but it's... Being bored is like a privilege. Damn, I lived long enough to be bored or damn, I'm stable enough to be content and bored and hear birds chirping and no sirens. And the chaos was consuming her mind and she couldn't even stop it. So even even after they convicted dude and got her off of, uh, got her out of prison, uh, got her out of prison and uh, only probation, she, that was like, she's supposed to get jail time. She got like four people murdered or sorry. Like she got like four people uh outed. They were trying to they was trying to convict her. Like she was going to jail. They was she was going to jail. So my thing was it was like she couldn't even she couldn't even gather herself mentally because she was in that energy so long. She was in that environment so long. She couldn't even gather herself mentally to pull herself out of it to have a normal life again. She had missed two probation two probation hearings or appointments, and she and, and Olivia was like. You feel like you should be in jail, and it's like it's it's that it's it's not playing victim, but if you can understand it, it's it's a lot of trauma in that that's gonna take a long time to get out of. And this is the same situation that we put in a lot of our kids in. They're surrounded by people that don't want the best for them. They want to do them harm. They have bad energy. They have bad entities attached to them, and they and I was like, they just sitting here trying to mingle with your kids, and 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 some of our kids, you know what I'm saying, like. I said at the beginning of the video, you don't know what your child is going to turn into. All we can do is do the best that we can and remove our children from the situation. Because even if even you see it all the time, rich kids, drug addicts, poor kids, some of them slang drugs. Some of them are smart. Some of them, they become doctors. Some of them become scientists. I don't say you. It, it just depends on the mental. And I, don't say, I, I saw I saw a beautiful quote. And I think I have reshared it, but it was just like, just because my physical body is there doesn't mean my mental has to be. And, and, and another word, another word that I'll use for that, I'll just say uh, astral projection. That I'm saying, just because my body is here, don't mean my mind is. Sometimes my mind be a whole nother place. God is good. If you like anything I said, give me a like, comment, subscribe. Probably my most well thought out video recently, just off of the top of my head of what I've been going through as far as parenting and stuff. Uh, give me a like, comment, subscribe, follow my other channels. Uh, 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 Night of Family Guy, uh, uh, Speaking Sports with Spivey, uh, me on Wes. Let's run these numbers up. I'm, I'm almost at 29k, pushing 30k. Uh, go ahead and give me an, give me another comment. I'm saying 28k, almost at 29k. Let's go. I don't even know where it came from. It just blew up. Let's go.